Hey everybody, welcome to, well, it's not the first day of the Series 12 ladder, but it's my first day on the Series 12 ladder. I didn't get a play yesterday, or the day before. Uh, so here we are. Uh, today, we're in Ultra Ball, or Great Ball 9. I'm using the Cramorant team. If you would like the rental code, go check out the rental code video. I'll put a card here, and I'll put like a link in the description. Hopefully I remember to do all that, because I said I would. Um... <clears throat> Yeah, I like this team a lot. Um, I know that, you know, it's Kramer is probably not the most optimal Pokemon to be running, but it's so fun to, like, catch people unaware. And Gulp Missile really is a good ability. If Kramer had better stats, like, it would probably just be pretty good. Wow, first battle of Series 12 on cart. That's crazy. Okay, um, what do we need here? <clears throat> the Rillaboom is scary. Um, grass types are the one thing that are very scary for me. Let's think. I think I'm gonna just go... Do I expect them to lead the Rillaboom? I don't know. I'm gonna do this. Let's go we'll just Cramorant Gastrodon. I'll bring a Veltal in the back. And I think I'll just bring Zace in. Like, honestly, that feels pretty okay. I could go Colossal here, but Colossal doesn't do anything into Dialga. You know what I mean? <clears throat> so it's kind of risky. Um, oh, as always, everybody, if you, if you like the video, leave a like. Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think about the, the Cramorant team. Tell me what kind of Pokemon you want to see in the format. I need to, you know, start working on stuff. I haven't played in a few days, and it's been... Just been busy, you know? Alright, they didn't leave the Rillaboom, so I feel pretty okay with what we're doing here. Um, here's the question though. Do we attack the Diago this turn or I wanna say yeah. I wanna say I'm just gonna quake the Dialga. This is a pretty straightforward team most of the time to be honest. Either you max Gastrodon turn one or you max Cole turn one and like There aren't really that many scenarios where that's not where you wanna do. I probably should have quaked the Grim Snarl to be honest, because if they max Dialga here. I'm gonna go for a light screen and their weakness policy, we might be in trouble. We'll see. <clears throat> a lot of people don't like to call that Gastrodon maxes, which is pretty interesting when you think about it. Like, they might call that we go for a yawn or something. Alright, so they, they do max the Diago. Um, they're probably gonna go for the light screen. Very rough start for us. Um... They're probably going to two-shot our Gastrodon, which isn't great. I don't know, maybe we can do, like, at least 50%, right? Hmm. They go for Fake Out. Okay. I mean, here that kind of does the same thing. They go for Lightning. They said, I don't want that Cramorant on the field. Okay. Interesting. <clears throat> really, really not what I would have expected. If I'm being completely honest. Yeah, maybe they thought I was going for a Yawn. If they thought I was going for Yawn, that's a, that, that play kind of makes sense. Oh, it's Life Orb. Okay. So it's not Weakness Policy. That's good for us. <clears throat> I want to say if they're running Fake Out, they're probably not running, like, other moves. Um, let me think about this. Let's go Zacian and just protect it, because they're really likely to just, like... I feel like they're pretty likely to just, like, speed control our Zacian if they have it. And if they don't have it, we'll know. I'm gonna just protect. Go for the Quake here. Um, this'll KO if they let me KO them. And they really shouldn't be doing that much damage back into Gastrodon. <clears throat> Let's see. Alright, so... 
They're not running screens. They're full, uh, they're full like scary face whatever. Ooh, the quake though is very scary. Um, they might take our attack because of that. <clears throat> Which isn't great, but it is what it is, you know? Actually, I think we might still KO. Based on how much we did before. Because we're not even... We're going to do more than half of what we did. Yeah, we still get the KO. Cool. And Zizan gets a nice little special defense boost, which is always nice. Alright, Kramer... has <clears throat> gone, but you know, like, it really drew their attention for some reason, and that kind of worked out in our favor. Ditto comes in. Okay, that's kind of scary. Not gonna lie. <clears throat> um, but you know, it's kind of fine. I'm gonna go ahead and s just switch into Yveltal. We don't really have a reason not to. And then I'll just Quake um, Grimmsnarl. It's the scarier Pokemon on the field right now. We didn't get any special attack boosts, so we're not doing as much damage as we could be. And it's not like they can max this uh, this Gastrodon. Yeah, it has two special defense boosts, but if we can just snarl it to death, it doesn't really mean anything. Because <clears throat> I imagine here they'd probably just go for Earth Power into into Zazian. If they do a Scarf, like it's really kind of a wasted item slot. It just kind of locks them into a move for no for nothing in return. Fake tears. <laughs> Oof. So we know three of their moves. <clears throat> Ooh, 50%. Okay, that's good. Good stuff. Special defense boosts are always nice. What's their last Pokemon? I don't remember what was on this team. I'm pretty bad about that. Oh, they... Okay, they're really restricted to ZC. They didn't bring it. Fun fact for anybody who doesn't know. I know I've talked about it before, but... Um, if your opponent brings their ZC or their Zamazenta, it'll be crowned in the, the screen here. So we know that they didn't bring it. Um, I'm assuming the last Pokemon isn't Rillaboom, because they would have brought it in, which means it's probably the Urshifu. I'm going to go ahead and just... Hmm. I'm going to Oblivion Wing the Grimmsnarl, and Earth Power the Grimmsnarl. That Dialga was pressure. I didn't PP Max my stuff. That's kind of bad. Oh, they just quit? Hey, that works for me. <laughs> I didn't PP Max anything, I don't think, which is bad. Um... Because I already released the rental code and I can't change it now. I can update it in a month, I guess. Yeah, let's get another one. That went pretty well. The first win. It's nice to win your first battle. It sets the tone for the rest of the season. Alright, Watt. <clears throat> Watt, you got... Kyogre. Alright, so um, probably that means we're not bringing Colossal again. Um, hmm, They're gonna bring that Rillaboom, though. They're gonna bring that Rillaboom. I'm gonna go Cram Gastrodon still. And... That's a Durant. That's interesting. Yo, that actually sounds... Well, he'd be pretty good. <laughs> that Durant might be great. I'm just gonna do the these four. Honestly, that feels safe. I could bring the Colossal, but I guess they don't really have much speed control, huh? Colossal might be kind of safe. Oh well, it's too late now. Cause like really the only thing Colossal doesn't want to deal with is the the Kyogre. It should like one shot everything else. Maybe not the Grim Snow. <clears throat> I 
I guess we'll see. If I lose, maybe I'll make a Durant team. Oh, they leave the Durant. I should have went for Colossal, I guess. Does Durant get any Grass-type moves? Let's see. Uh, Durant. Pokemon. Only Kevin Durant came up. Uh, let me know in the comments if you like Kevin Durant. I personally don't feel very strongly about him at all. It only gets Energy Ball, and there's no way it's running Energy Ball. Um, doesn't it get Entrainment, though? What if it's Entrainment? I'm just gonna go for Surf. Quake the Durant. Like I said, they don't really have anything to hit me with. <coughs> they can really only run Bug and... I mean, the Durant's type coverage isn't bad. It just doesn't have a Grass-type move unless they're running Energy Ball. Why would they run Energy Ball? Wow, Duran has pretty good stats. Only its special defense is bad, but like, throw an Assault Vest on there? Maybe I will make a Durant team. Let me know if you want to see a Durant team. Let me know if you want to see a Kevin Durant team. Huh. Maybe I should have Feather Danced. <clears throat> I thought about it. Oh, they go for fake out in the Gastrodon? <laughs> Can't wreck. That did a good chunk of damage. Durant's special defense is really low. We might even KO with the Max Quake, to be honest. Oh, and they Rock Fall? Yeah, this Durant's going down. Rock Fall into Cram means they're taking another... Well, they're, they're Max, so it'll be another 12.5%. But, like, trading my Cramorant for their Dynamax... <laughs> trading my Cramorant for their Dynamax is absolutely worth it. It's Life Orb. Oh, yeah. This is probably just going down to this. Yeah. <coughs> Gosh. Sorry about the coughing. It's in the morning, and... For some reason, I just, every morning, I have phlegm in my throat, and I can't cough it up. Sorry if that sounds gross. And this Grimmsnarl just takes damage from sand, and I don't. That's so nice. Uh, hmm, what comes in? <coughs> they had a Zacian, right? I should have checked to see if they brought it. I'll just bring in my Zacian. That should, that's probably pretty safe. Goithmic? Oh, Garithmic? Gar That's a great name. <laughs> Yo, Garithmic? What what language is that? Does anybody know? I need I need a real room that's this language. Garithmic is a great name. Um, you know, we probably take one grassy glide, right? Like probably? I'm gonna do this. If I don't take the Grassy Glide, that's fine. I probably don't need um, it anymore. Oh no, we don't. We don't take one Grassy Glide. That's a big oof. I should probably EV for that next time. Scary face? I mean, I guess. <clears throat> we might actually lose this game. Depending on what's in the back. Grimstarl is so good, guys. Like, it kind of amazes me how good Grimstarl is all the time. Yeah, I probably should have just, like, max guarded, went for Behemoth Blade into the Rillaboom. That was probably would have been smart. So it's there, Zacian. Okay. It is what it is. Um, I know that I should take one attack from their Zacian unless they double me. Would they double Zacian here? I guess it depends on if they think Zacian's gonna protect or not. Because if Zacian protects, then doubling Yveltal's the best play for them. I'm just gonna go for this. I'm gonna double the... their Zacian. 
Because Evolto should take one attack from it. And if we can KO it... Oh, really? It's max attack. Um, they're never max attack. That's crazy. Please get a crit. Please crit for me. Critical hit. No such luck. Dang, man. <laughs> I guess I should have sucker punched. Oof. Ah, oh, Sucker Punch would have KO'd. I thought I took a play rough. I really did. I don't take one play rough. It makes me sad. Um, I don't like this AC and just automatically runs play rough now. It makes me sad. All right, well, I just lose this game, but we'll play out the last turn. If they disconnect, we win. Gotta play to your outs. Yeah, there it is. We go down to that. <clears throat> yeah, that has to mean it's max attack ZCN, because I think we take it from not max attack ZCN. Which is not very common on the ladder. Or, well, it's not very common on Showdown anyway. That's a big oof. Yeah, you also doesn't have Protect, so... There's no way, really, way out of that. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, let's keep battling. We'll get one more. That's a rough start. <laughs> I don't like that. Can I can I lose less points, please? Is it lose all of my points? I hate climbing the Master Ball every month. I really do. It's very annoying. Um, I really just want to bring Colossal to a game, but like nobody wants me to, I guess. Nobody wants to play a team where that's possible. Which is, you know, part of why Colossal is pretty bad. I could have just led Colossal in that last game. It would have been great, actually. But they, they I guess they bet on me leading Gastrodon. <clears throat> well, I guess they had Fake Out. They did have Fake Out. So they could have, like, faked out my Cramorant and KO'd it. Or faked out Cramorant and killed Colossal, I guess. There's a lot of speed control in this format. The fact that Grimmsnarl is, like, scary face whatever more often than it is screens is kind of crazy. I personally prefer screens Grimmsnarl, but... You know? This guy's taking a long time, and I'm just rambling on. Maybe they time out. I guess if they lead Zacy and Kyogre, we'll know they timed out. Oh, no, they finished before time was up. Let's see if they lead their Kartana. That would be bad for us. Okay, yeah, they just lead Kyogre. That's great. <laughs> That's perfect. Um, <clears throat> what do they expect us to do here? Intimidate's fine. You think they're Thunder Kyogre? They probably are, right? If this was their lead, they're probably Thunder Kyogre. And they have two Max Quake uh, things they can switch in. I'm gonna just go for the Surf. And I'll Earth, I'll Max Quake into Kyogre. If I were them, I'd probably expect the Max Quake into Incin more. But, like, honestly, you can never really be too sure. No, come on. Please? Okay, Kartana doesn't want to take this. Cortana actually might go down to this. Um, there's actually a chance that Cortana goes down to this. If they don't fake out Cramorant. Which, like, feels like a pretty easy play, so we'll see.
They do fake out. Ah, that's that's rough. That's rough for me. Okay, that's fine. Kermit flinches. We get the quake off. <clears throat> that is a lot of damage. Um, they cannot max that anymore. Oh, I can just hurricane it. It'll go down to a hurricane. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna hurricane the... I've got no reason not to. And I will... I'll, I'll try to quake the Ensign. If they switch into a flying type here, I'll be pretty sad, but... This Kartana shouldn't take a hurricane. Uh, I mean, maybe if it maxes, but... That'd be pretty... That'd be pretty wild for them to do. Ensign will take the max quake, because I'm not boosted. I'm not gonna get any boosts. Because I had to hurricane here. This is gonna be a scary game, guys. It's gonna be a very scary game. Kartana switches back out into Hoomst. Into Zacian. Alright, well, I mean, Confusion would be cool. I'd be down. That means they didn't bring any flying types, so I can just Quake with Abandon. Confusion? 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 No. Parting shot. Uh, into Cramorant, though. Okay. So Kyogre is going to take this Quake for free. I mean, it won't do that much damage, but it should do like at least like 30% or something. Depending on the spread, of course. <clears throat> okay, yeah. It's, it's not as bulky as it could be. It's not super bulky, Kyogre. 're trying to just stall out my Dynamax which is you know fair um I, this Asian's got to protect right I'll just double the Kyogre there's no way this Asian doesn't protect because if it doesn't protect it goes down to max quake and who knows we could get you know like hurricane crit confusion <laughs> that's always an option. Whenever there's a chance for something to happen, it can happen. Zacian does protect. Okay, let's see if the Kyogre protects, because I don't think it will. Ooh, goodbye, Kyogre. Yeah, it just goes down to this. Ice Beam doesn't even KO Cremorant. They're really trying to get rid of it. That's crazy. Why? Alright, that's one KO. They still have three Pokemon. I mean, I guess trading my Dynamax for Kyogre isn't awful. Um, Kartana's at such low HP now that <clears throat> it's not really great for them to max it. Instant comes back in. Okay. That's fair. Now, where do I expect the fake out to go? What are they more scared of? I'm gonna go ahead and switch. Um, what's safer? Do they have a Behemoth Blade Crown right here? I'm gonna switch to Zacian. And I will. I'm gonna go for the Earth Power in a Zacian. I don't expect to get it. I expect to get faked out. What are they going to do here? They're maxing Incineroar. But why? <clears throat> I mean, I guess they don't really have another option, but... That feels weird to me. I don't think this would be the turn to, like, use your max here. I feel like you could have waited. Play rough into Gastrodon. I wonder if they just doubled Gastrodon. It looks like they did. That's so weird. Why? I hate that play. That play makes me mad. It makes me mad only because it worked so well. 
All right, let's get Kramer back in, I guess. That speed drop matters a lot, but their their instant shouldn't be faster than me yet. I'm gonna go ahead and what am I gonna do? Hmm. I'm going to I could feather dance here. Oh man, I don't know. I want to surf, but I want to not surf. My Zacian's slower than theirs now. That's the problem. I'll switch. And go for a feather dance. Really? Why? What? You know, honestly, I want to call BS on that play. Your Zacian was in no danger. Well, you're able to eat that up. Yeah. Ah, uh, they're probably just gonna flare again, right? What do I do? Um. I don't even know, man. I guess I'll just Oblivion Wing. And I'll Feather Dance again. Yikes. Max Incineroar is always so annoying. <laughs> so now they're at minus one. And we know they have Play Rough, so it's weirder than to go for Behemoth Blade here. I should take that, actually. Yeah, I take that really well. Just for some damage. A little bit of health back. That's actually a lot of health back. Max Flare again. Um, honestly, that shouldn't do too much. Okay, that's actually a lot. That's more than I wanted. Um... That did a lot of damage. Are they running a lot of attack? That's crazy. I can't really switch in Zacian safely here. Let me just Oblivion Wing the Instant again. And... I'll go for another Feather Dance. But I'll... I wonder if they just protect Zacian. I'll just go for it. We'll see. This is probably the wrong play. I probably don't take minus three play rough, but I guess, you know, we'll see. There it is. They miss? Ooh. Oh, man. And it was in a Cramorant. They really want to get rid of my Cramorant. That's a decent little chunk. Get some HP back. We should take a Flare Blitz now, I think. Yo, man. Why are you running so much attack on your... On your Ensign. What are you doing? Now I can't switch Kramer and out. Now we're stuck into... Now we're stuck in Feather Dance. Which isn't, like, awful in this situation. But it's not great. I'm just going to close combat the Incineroar, honestly. That's my best play here. Um, Their Zacian's kind of a non-threat as long as they don't crit me. I will get one more Feather Dance off. Because then they'll be at minus 5, I guess. Okay, that KO's Kartana, so that's fine. I guess Behemoth Blade into Zacian might have been better. Because now they get to switch, right? <clears throat> and now they get an Intimidate and Fake Out Pressure. Oh, they, they don't get to switch their Zacian. Their Zacian stays at all these minus stages. Kale Kramer. Oh, Kramer, it lives. Kramer, you're beautiful.
I mean, if they fake out Kramer, they probably just KO it, right? I need to go for this, I think. Oh, they just give up. Hey, that's a win. <laughs> Thank you, Feather Dance. They're like, oh, well, I'm not going to do any damage. I guess they don't think that they can... I don't know. They, they definitely could have won if they, like, just crit Behemoth Blade or something. All right, well, that's the video, guys. Um, we end up basically just plus one on the ladder, which is pretty rough. That's pretty rough. I, um... Man. I should just play better, I guess, you know? That's always what it amounts to, right? Anyway, um... If you like this video, guys, please leave me a like. Leave me a comment. Tell me what Pokemon you want to see in the future. Is it Durant? Durant sounds fun. <laughs> um, if you're all the way here at the end and you're not subscribed, please, please, please subscribe. Like, obviously, you watched me for, like, 30 minutes. You saw something you liked. Anyway... With that, everybody, my name is Andrew, and I will catch you guys next time.